a complete ammonite just laying right there in the mud. And man, this thing has some type of fish scales like you wouldn't believe. And it's definitely fossilized. Check out those roots. Man. Welcome back to another adventure, miners, prospectors, and rock hounders. It's always good to see you all back at the channel. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you like what you see and you decide to subscribe. All right, so can anybody take a guess where we're at today? We're at the Ammonite Creek. At least that's what I call my spot. Ammonite Creek behind me. Huge ammonites can be found out here. Hopefully today we'll get lucky and find some on the surface. Unfortunately, I locked my toolbox and I don't have my key to get in. So RD1, the rotary drill one is locked up. Hopefully I won't need it. But if we do come across an ammonite that's stuck in the matrix slash the mud, I won't be able to get it out because I don't have my RD1. But we can always come back and work on getting that ammonite out of the matrix. All right, enough said. Let's get the walking in the creek and see if we can find some cool fossils. Since I have been here last, this has all been washed. Like this cold cliff don't even, oh, check that out. Here's something right here, like a like a piece of an ammonite. But as I was saying, all of this has changed. This is all different. This doesn't look, I used to cross right there. I don't remember seeing these ever, these big, huge concrete columns. Those must have washed down. I'm going to walk around and we're going to try to get a complete ammonite i found several complete ammonites along that ridge it's got the bleach look to them they were really cool looking but jan all this dirt has collapsed it just seems like the water has really ripped through this cliff right here so it could have exposed more oh my gosh i see an ammonite all the way over there i see some over there i just can't get to them man But I have found a couple ammonites even over here on this. Yep, there's one right there. I see one. Man, it's right there. Maybe this summer I can get out here and we'll get the ammonites that are on the other side of the creek. But for now, we're going to head down to the spot, which is just straight, straight ahead. Check this out. Wow, what is this? This looks like a vertebrae. It could be a vertebrae or one of those huge barbs off a of shrimp or however you say it that huh yeah, that's kind of weird if i save that hang on to that one let's see what we got here oh nice check that one out awesome i got a small one just like i was wanting to get oh man it's perfect even has the spikes beautiful you know, if we can get this video to 3,000 likes within three weeks of being uploaded, I will give this ammonite away along with several other ammonites that I find will have several winners, not just one. So get this video shared out and click that thumbs up button. Wow. That is so awesome. We flip it over, of course it's got the, but it's got some good detail, that's for sure. I could maybe chip that off. All right, let's grab this other one. This thing here and uh, see what else we can get. I've uh, just been walking around pretty much all that area. And all I have in my pocket are my keys. So I'll mark this one right here with my keys. Oh, it's a little one. A little bit of detail right there. Looks like a good giveaway. Oh, yeah. A little bit of a ammonite there. Looks like another giveaway. Let's head on down to the spot. See if we can get some good ones. Right now I'm putting everything over here by the road. Oh, what's that? Nothing. There's just all types of fossils out here. 
you can even find sand fossilized sand dollars they're embedded in this mud there'll be sand dollars in that stuff piece of an ammonite right there and tumbled and here's a broken one Ugh. oh nice detail you could cut that and it's set up on the shelf that's some good detail to it get over here to the good spot where all the big ones like to hang around I can't believe I forgot the key to my toolbox man bummer I'm 45 minutes from my house this stuff has been tumbling which is good there's some it's like it's broken there's a piece there's a piece small imprint oh man that's one that's got to be an ammonite just a little different oh there's a couple pieces of them but that right there is definitely some type of ammonite and look at that just a big chunk of sand really here's some more of that round long type of almost like some type of a stem of a plant to me that's what that is it's like a huge plant that's been fossilized that's the stem awesome i'm gonna keep that man things like at least 15 pounds 10 pounds oh there's something right there got some ammonite right there I just broke it. Oh well. Wasn't all that great. But yeah, this is really cool. And here's a broken one. Alright, time to get over to the spot. I'm gonna go put this by the road. And right there's the beginning of the spot, right there on the edge of the water. This is really cool here type of plant formation I was headed back to the uh, road to put that long stem looking fossil with everything else look what I missed walking out onto the uh, gravel bar a complete ammonite just laying right there in the mud surprise this thing isn't broken let's go ahead and pull it up man look at that oh it is complete both sides <laughs> yeah oh look at the detail on that absolutely beautiful Woohoo! got a pretty good nick right there but you can just flip it around like that and boom complete ammonite all right it's gonna be a good day let's get out there and get some more All right, we got a pretty good little pile going on right now. Wow, that was awesome. Found a full ammonite just sitting there by the road and I overlooked it. Can't believe I've missed it heading out to the uh, gravel bar, but we got it. Time to grab the backpack and head on over here to the good spot. Yeah, that was so cool. Oh man. Oh, muddy. Yeah, normally I'm able to walk like right through here. I can walk, but not today. I really don't have the right boots for this. We better fix that. All right, perfect. Now we can get across this water. Look at all the minnows. Thousands of little minnows. I can see those. All right, we are back. It's been a good, golly, four or five months. Feels good to be back at Ammonite Creek. And all this is new. Like, there could be some new stuff right here. Anywhere could be an Ammonite. 
piece of one. Oh, there's a broken one. Looking for the smaller ones today. I want to give you guys some ammonites. If you'd like to have a large ammonite, you can always go to my eBay and purchase larger ammonites. There's a nice half. One I could cut, it'll stand up on its own. It'll stand up without cutting it. Cool, it's got like a hole in it. Look at that rock. It's very unusual. Oh, it's one of these uh, plant looking rocks. Looks like some type of uh, coral reef fossilized plant life or something. Wow, definitely gonna keep that one. It's got that hole in it. Which is really cool. Man, lots of cool stuff down here. This might be a half. Yeah, it's a piece of a huge ammonite. Look how big that one would have been. That's off of ammonite, guys. That thing would have been so big, I would have a hard time picking that one up. I would do it. I would get it to the truck, but it would take me half a day. We usually just kind of squeeze down there, but now I got to climb over all that. Man, I'm excited to get over there. That's the hot spot. The visitor's here. Nice doggy, I hope. Oh, look at that one. Wow. Man, I did not leave this here. Oh, look at this one. Oh, right off the bat, we're starting to see stuff left and right. Man, all this has been just destroyed. This is not the way it was when I left. I did not leave that there. Oh, wow. Man, it's cracked. But it's a big, heavy ammonite. We'll leave it like that. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's broken. Yep, yeah, it's just a broken one. Cool, this is gonna be fun. Like all this has been broken, washed away from the water, releasing new fossils and ammonites to be found. So I just crossed over. I'm starting to see signs of ammonites all over the place unreal check this one out definitely gonna need the uh, rotary drill for that one it's kind of busted up but it can be saved man all this water has been all the way up to there washing all those roots out look at those roots wow man that's absolutely insane let's get the sun behind the tree so y'all can check out those roots. Man, that could be an ammonite in there. Look at those. Wow. Now you have a better idea how big these roots are. Woo! Let's see what else we can get. Do -do -do. Oh, here's one. Oh, here's one. There's one. I'll bust it up, but here's a big one. I mean, this thing is going to be so well preserved because it's been inside all this mud. Man, I need that RD1. We're going to come back and work on this one right here. See if we can't get this one freed because I can just see right there. I mean, it's just incredible. And you see right here, we have an ammonite and the detail is absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna have to get the RD1 and get this. Uh. There's one, not far from the big one that's in the uh, rock. And right up from this one, I saw this one right here. Look at that little guy. Oh, it's gonna come out. Yep. Oh, nice. It's got a crack but it's still a nice small ammonite. Whew. Clean that one up a little bit. 
but it is split right there darn and we haven't had a lot of rain if we could get a hard rain it would wash up so much more Ooh, look at this one man gosh just the pieces of one though it's all the inners it's all must have shriveled up pretty good probably need to come back this way i missed one or two oh there's an imprint another imprint and down here i noticed an ammonite oh i noticed that imprint too so that got me looking and i saw this one right here sticking out oh and it's a complete ammonite yes look at that Woo yeah nice Woo! yeah baby oh yeah that's what i'm talking about Woo, and it's a complete ammonite check that one out yes it's a little muddy not the best detail but it's a complete it's a complete uh, fractured or any i don't see any uh cracks or anything in it so it's a really good one just not the best detail Woo, that little bit was sticking out oh that's not a good let's see we got a that print and then over here it looks like a possibly a deer <laughs> like a dog chasing a deer it might be a uh, coyote coyote oh all right awesome man i can't believe how much all this has oh man there's one there's one right there i can get out with the uh, rd1 Ooh, look at that imprint look at there look at there another little imprint i like to find them in the water it's always fun and speaking of in the water that's right here something in there for sure and that water got all the way up to that blue there's a like a blue rag or something hanging in the uh, tree that's how high the water got up here it got like way up in there meaning it was over my head imagine that much water just crazy that's pretty cool the current going up that way coming down and it's making the current this is really neat right here Look at that. Oh, it's broken though. Some type of plant. Looks like a that is a giant foot. Whoa, look at that. Really cool. No ammonites under it though. Nope. Oh, look at those. Oh, it broke. Man, like all this is just new. This wasn't like this. Remember, there was a huge tree right here. And this is all changed. But man, this one's broke. That's probably a piece of it right there. No, I don't think that one, that has nothing to do with this one. That's a separate piece. Man. Man, oh man. 
Oh, ooh, that's big. That's big. That's big. It's big, but it's, mm, it's hard to tell. Oh, split for one. <laughs> but man, that's a big one. Oh, man, that split. And that is deep. And I believe we have reached the end of the road because I do not have waders to go across like I normally like to do and check out those spots. Some of you may remember this here in the videos and I finally broke it free. And man, this thing has some type of fish scales like you wouldn't believe. And it's definitely fossilized. Unreal. That is just crazy. I don't know what this is. I didn't know it was going to finally break, but look how scaly that is. Definitely some, some type of fish or reptile. I mean, all this right here, this whole thing is a fossil. Here's some more scales. Oh my gosh, look at that. Wow, look at that. Let's take a look at it through the better camera. And here's a closer look at this weird looking fossil. I mean, this thing has got some scales. Fish scales or a reptile, like a dinosaur. I mean, unreal. All up in here. This right here is part of it. You can just see right there, there's the rock. And then that thin, I mean, it's probably the fossil, like <laughs> the creature, whatever it was, you know, what's left of it. Look at this. Look at the scales on that thing. What did I find? If you know what this is, be sure and leave a comment. Man. Yeah, it's all busted up. Oh, look at this little imprint. Look at that small imprint of the ammonite. That's the smallest one yet. So they can get that size. Wow. Yeah, this is just blowing my mind right here. I don't want to break it up too much. It's already broken. Ooh, look at this piece right here. Now this has been like inside all this rock. And that's definitely, that's definitely some type of scale of a fish. Ooh, look at that. Wow, this is so crazy. This is insane. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's part of the fish. No doubt about it, guys. We found a fossilized fish. Or some type of creature, that's for sure. That's what this is. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. That is part of the creature. Oh my gosh, this is insane. This is absolutely insane. I don't really see a whole lot more. It's just the mud. It's like half of a creature. I mean, this is definitely scaly. Look at all the scales and this piece was like Oh, see, it's flaking away. Oh, man. Oh, no. So fragile. All this is so fragile. But this piece right here, this definitely has part of the creature in it. Look at that. Right there. Oh, man. Wow. I've always wondered what this thing was. And I kicked it with my foot. And I pulled one of these pieces out. No, it was always this piece right here. Is that right there? I could always see that there was something right there, that little round, dark, right there by my thumb. And that's what it was. The remains of some ancient fish or reptile creature. Man, this is awesome. Huge discovery here at the uh, Ammonite Creek. Okay, I'm just getting the uh, fossil that I just found, the fish or reptile or getting everything put in my backpack. Get this out of here. Get this uh, 
here's the big piece man that's unreal put that down in there like that and I'm not sure what else I didn't see a whole lot more we had this had some some type of indicators here maybe give that to a museum it's almost like a goldfish <sighs> crazy there's something oh yep there's something I'm not sure what else I didn't see a whole lot more just that it's like at one time it was it's like it was face down and it got broken half you know because this was all fossilized so whatever it was it got broken half and the rest is probably gone and let's take a look at what i found today or at least what i uh brought home these three right here are going to be part of the giveaway this one will be the first one here's second and here'd be the third this one right here was sitting on the surface has amazing detail awesome and here's the bigger one it's complete oh that thing is heavy got some mud got some of the concrete attached to it it's really mud but i call it concrete because it's just like concrete yeah this one's really cool here are the stems at least that's what i'm calling them not sure what else it could be very cool the possible fish to me that's like the head of it i mean this thing is just crazy it's got some crazy scales going on right there and over here on this side that's got some really good detail of the scales definitely some type of fish i'm thinking it's like a massive goldfish <laughs> And then this piece right here, this is what I found first. So I was able to pull it out of the mud today. It just released out of it. Yeah, I may have been able to remove it a little better if I had my RD1. I could have chiseled around it and probably pulled all this out in one piece. But it was all fractured up. Either way, it was going to be all broken like this. So I guess it didn't really matter. Looks like the imprint this piece right here was kind of like more internal as you can see it's really got some scales right there just a lot of weird stuff going on i was checking out this creature here and that piece that was uh really well preserved fits right there all right and then and then all of this connects into that right there. Let me tell you, that was a pretty good size fish or whatever it is. I really don't know what it is. Ancient alligator gar. You know, the scales are very, very similar to a uh, alligator gar or some type of reptile. Also, this piece right here broke off. It's the mud. And it helped reveal more of the creature, as you can see right there, which is really, really cool. Here's all the imprints. 
Those are just imprints from where it came off of this area. That was all attached to here and on the other side. enjoy these videos here at the ammonite spot i've tried to arrange it to where others can come out here and gather ammonites and fossils but the landowner just doesn't want people out here so it's just going to be a private spot unfortunately but every chance i can get out here and make videos and share my adventures i'm going to and i thank you all for the support and watching these videos and i believe that's going to wrap it up here at the ammonite creek location north central texas i hope you all enjoyed the video thank you all for watching and the support and i'll see you on the next video